Good luck in the race. Winner gets four spots. Lucky number seven on your mark. Get set. Go. All right. So we got them all shuffled up at the line here. Jay, John P., you're out front. Joe, battle it up to win these four spots. Good luck, gentlemen. Good little friendly race. Five seconds left. Three, two, one. Look at this, Joe. Oh, wow. You beat the odds. Wow. Surprise, surprise. You beat the odds there because John had it all going on for the chances with that. Let's get to the randomizer and see who gets which checklist players. So every spot that you got in this break is worth six checklist players. So all I did was multiply our spot owner names by six. And we're going to random each list seven times and stack the list up side by side. And you'll easily be able to see your checklist um, players in just a moment here as we get both lists randomized. Boom. And onto this little spreadsheet. And what's really fun is we do have more of these breaks. I'm really excited for everybody that got in to this thing. This is like one of those kinds of breaks where you can hit so big and pull a Mickey Mantle autograph or some of the big ones in here. Ho! Seven times through for the owner names. All right, lucky number seven. Okay, let's send our um, next list through here and just see yep, all those have been randomed. You'll notice it's staggered one number, and that's just because number one on our spreadsheet is occupied by this. So it's, it's all staggered by a number. Okay, here comes the um, player checklist player random. Seven times through. Good luck, everyone. In the box break, let's pull a Nolan Ryan. Derry Jeter. Seven times. Ho! Lucky number seven.
You know, you'll notice Mickey Mantle is not on the checklist, and some of the big legendaries are not on the checklist. If we pull in any name that's not on the checklist, it'll go to random between everybody in the break. We will copy the owner name list and send them through the randomizer, and the winner will be on the top list after seven. So if we pull a legendary, it just goes to random between the entire owner name list. Okay, so uh, here we go. There is um, your ownership here with every uh, checklist player. So many big names. Don Magley there for Joe. I know he's a Yankees fan. He'd love to see a Don Magley. Mariano Rivera. Right there, John. Derek Jeter for Dean. Just going on down the list, man. Cal Ripken Jr. Joe. Ho. Dustin Pedroia, one of my personal faves. <laughs> okay. So there it is. There it is. Let's do this. Let's pull a Mickey Mantle up out of here. Yeah, so I'll be able to scroll around. You'll be able to see the entire list. It's just condensed or whatever. I can scroll around anywhere on that list. Come on, treasure. Archive signature series buyback autographed edition. One encased buyback hits. What's it going to be? Who's it going to be? It's a Chili Davis. It is a parallel. It's an 89 top style Chili Davis. It's, I guess, an original. Not. We're, we're going to look at the back. I'm pretty sure that's an original card that's, that's uh, 89 tops. So you can see the parallel. And it looks like 68 to me. Yeah, it's got that special stamp. A nice autographed Chili Davis. Yeah, it's definitely an 89 top style card. Okay, it's an 89 tops original. Sometimes you'll have a card like this. It could be a buyback card. And it looks like an 89 tops, but it's a, you know, it's still not an original 89 tops. And I'm sure you can follow me because we all know there's some great cards that are autographed and they'll look like one year. They can be another. But let's get to this. Let's let's see who's got Chili Davis on our list. Chili Davis. John P., congratulations. This is your hit. It is a Chili Davis autograph. Ho! And I can't tell. Yeah, it's 68 is what it is. That's the number. It's 1 through 68 uh, for these kinds of hits that can come out of this particular card in the set. Yeah. Chili Davis, let's take a look over his career, man. What did he do? I'm posting up the next one of these. You know we're looking for a Mickey Mantle or something, but what did Chili Davis do in his career? I don't remember him too well, and I'm kind of an old cat. Oh, it looks like he's a, a Jamaican. He's a Jamaican man. Three-time All-Star, three-time World Series champ. Is he in the Hall of Fame? Long career. Looks like he played a lot with the Angels. I don't know if he's in the Hall of Fame. I don't see that in his accolades. 
So he's not a Hall of Famer. From Kingston. Isn't that where Bob Marley's from? A lot of teams. That's a really legendary autograph to have. It's like, uh, he may have been done some years coaching too. We should Wikipedia him. You can find out all about Chili Davis. Well, he had a long career. Let's get out of Bay. Here's our wiki. Because he's probably done some managing. It looks like he's stayed in baseball. Look at that. As a coach, the Mets. The Cubs, yeah, he's he's definitely been a part of baseball for a long time. So we didn't pull a Hall of Famer, but we have somebody who's been, he's on the, the Giants Wall of Fame. He's been a staple in baseball for like four decades. That's really cool. 19-year career. And then all those years coaching. Pretty epic. Great hit, man. What a story. Chili Davis. Hope. I'll be linking up more of this Archive Signature Series as we are going for a Mickey Mail or something. That is so cool.